Hizi yes. stories za miujiza, mm -hmm. omba, mm -hmm. utasaidiwa, mm -hmm. e, watu wanatembea. Mm -hmm. Have you ever been disappointed yourself? No, uh, because um, I know God for myself. I don't know God who I've been told. Okay. So I know God for myself and for every problem and for every issue in life, there's an answer in the word of God. Yes. So I know how to seek God for myself. And I know if a false prophet tells me something, I will know outright because I'll measure that with the word of God. And, and I will know this is balance. a fake person and I will, I will either know this is a fake person or I will know this is a voice from God. Ah. Yes. Dr. Kingori, yes. let, me, let me just intervene. Kidogo too. Yes. There is mm, something very, very evil in the religion gymnastics. <laughs> <laughs> Number one. That brainwashing people okay. if you brainwash people they start now seeing you as god okay. not as pastor now whatever you tell them they have to do so if you tell them kuja <laughs> hapa it's all these 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 are funny things i don't I, by the way i hate religion i love god I don't like religion. That's a solid point. And do you feel like our our ma, ma, ma religious gymnasts, our our tuwa miujiza na kuruka, eh, tembea, wanawaribia kazi? Watu, wanatuaribia sana. Kwanza, kwanza, mungu <laughs> wanatuaribia. Kwanza, kwanza, mimi yata sitaka kikuitua pasta. Tukikuta na kwa street, mimi mankush. Kwa sababu kiniita pasta, kuna mtu mungini ya mefanyua kitendo mbaya na pasta. Amenyanganyo wa nyumba, in the name of Jesus. <laughs> Amen. I'm not a in the name of Jesus. Then you call me, you categorize me in that in that category. No, 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 no. Mimi ni pastor nikiwa na ubiri. Nikitoka hapo mankush. You get what I mean? Kwa sababu tumeharibiwa. Unajua kila soko ina wazimu. Na wazimu, wazimu wa religion, wamekojoa sokoni. No. Na zao kikojoa sokoni, sisi zote ambao ni mapasa, tunaonekana kama tunataha kukojoa ene uwea. That, 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 that's very bad. Actually, it's not even evil. It's abomination. <laughs> you, have, you, have, you, you have a point. But then, uh, that's not the only thing that's affecting the Initwaje Christianity as a whole. Uh, I came across an article, a very interesting article. In fact, I took the quote ya Nairobi News. Nairobi News carried a story. Na one of the quotes ilikuwani, the Kenyan gospel music industry has moved from being noble, upright, and honorable cause, uh, oh, honorable cause. It was in the, in the days uh, of Ruben Kigame, Mary Atieno, and Esther Wahome to become one of the most scandalous and shameful industries we have in this country. That is from Nairobi News. You, both of you guys are musicians. Yeah, I'm, I'm a grandfather in music. Ah, <laughs> lovely. Mm -hmm. So, tukianza na we, Esther, yes. unafilaji about gospel industry, kwa sababu ata hiyo pia, mm -hmm. ile perception inakuwa nayo, mm -hmm. inachangia kwa watu wanabebaje Christianity. Mm -hmm. Well, what I can say is that it is people who have changed. The gospel has not changed. We never stopped singing, mm -hmm. but there was kind of a cartel that wanted to show music that doesn't make any sense. A cartel? And uh, uh, that's what I would call it. Like, okay. uh, you look at um, any gospel show, so how many songs do you see that minister to people, and how many songs do you, do you see that just entertain? Do you see the likes of Sarah Kay, Jemai Mathiongo, Esther Wahome, uh, Mary Atieno, and... Um, Mankush. Yes, and Mankush. <laughs> 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 so I think... I think it's the people who change. The gospel did not change, and the gospel industry does not belong to any man. It belongs to God. Okay. And he preserves those, those ha that have respected their call and opens door for them each and every door. They never stop. They never die. True. But those who die are those who play with their calls. Those who get diminished are those who play with because gospel music is not like secular music. Yes. Gospel music is a call. Gospel music has values and has calls that govern you even as you sing. Yes. Gospel music is about the life you live and what you sing should be what you live. It should be a call before being a business and before being anything else. If you come out of there and you're chasing money and fame, 
then you get messed up in the whole thing. At the end of the day, this is w what is happening. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mankush, you share the same sentiments? Well, I'll, I'll support my, my sister because uh, <coughs> why, why do we have uh, our watu wanazunguka wakigangalia the standard ya, ya products? Kwa sababu kuna original na kuna ingine ata madawa kuna dawa original na kuna zingine ambazo zimeletwa michele tunasikia hata kuna ingine ya plastic eh. mayai tunasikia inatengenezewa Uganda na wa China <laughs> na hawana kuku you get what i mean yes. kwa hivyo katika hiyo mchanganyiko yes. you find that now people are, are, are those, those who don't have the word in them they are lost somewhere yeah. and they, they now they now go to and especially as we grow priority changes like now, they are, they are, to, to me, there is music I can't reason. Because to me, it's nonsense. Shigiribadi. Sasa, ata, ata ukisumamu wanza kusema, nasikia nyege. <laughs> kila mutu anasikia, kila mutu wako nazo. Mankush. No, no, no. <laughs> Mankush. Hakuna, hakuna haja ya kuenda kuifanya, kuifanya na tuliko na watoto ambao wanakuwa. And we are supposed to be role model. As to home is a role model to many young girls who want to be gospel, Musician, even the other guys, they are still having their role models. Kwa hivyo kuna watu wanafuata jambo ambalo, hawajui mwisho yake. Mankush, hiyo uh, kitu umesema siyo gospel. Sasa na shindu ulito ananayo wafu. <laughs> but daddy, niko na TV kwangu. Na niko na radio. Sitting room na bedroom niko na karedio kadogo. Unasikia? Okay. Huwezi kuzima, ati kwa sababu imeanza kuimba. Kwa sababu yule jamaa, hata kama ni Christian person who is there. An ameokoka. Sasa tuseme, wewe, you are, you are, you are, you are the, the host of Weekend, the Weekend people. Ah, not, not the Weekend people. <laughs> you are the host of <laughs> But you see, you see, NTV does not belong to you. It belongs to somebody else. So you are kept there. So that you can, you can, unaweza imba tu nyimbo zake, za mwenye ya mekuandika. Hata kama umeokoka, lazima ucheze hizo nyimbo. Kwa sababu hiyo program, yes. ni ya hizo nyimbo. Hata kama umeokoka. Kwa hivyo, habari ya kusikia, lazima usikia kwa sababu ya siki ziwi. Okay. Naona, kejana mwingine ya liniuliza, pa, mankush, pastor kuria, ukiona dempo wa mepita, unaweza angaria, ni kamuambia, wani mimi ni kipofu. <laughs> Lazima nione, lazima nione, lazima nione. Kufuata, dio decision yangu. So, so when ni pastor, unaenjoy kujitempt sa ingine, uone mali uneza fika? Ah, si jitempt, natemtiwa. <laughs> natemtiwa, you know. Yeah. And I, I can't run away from it, but I thank God. He has given me something that many people does not have, but is still in the word of God, self-control. Oh, so that's you test limits, that your self-control. Yeah, yeah. And you exercise the fruit. Una, u, u, hata ukipreach pale, kuna mtu anaweza ingia na unasema, Yesu ni buwana! Yesu ni buwana! Yeah, yeah. Yesu ni buwana! I am saved, but I am still a human being. I don't deny that I am a human being, my brother. What, 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 what controls me is the self-control and the principles that I have in my life. Many people are principleless. Okay. That's why we call them use. Less. Oh, I think, Basi, a logical explanation as per what you've said, uh, you talked about uh, calling, but some people get lost. Mm -hmm. Some people have, have a calling, but they, don't, they do not have the self-control kama ya mankush. Mm. So, wakienda hapo kwa yesu ni buwana, wanabaki hapo. And that maybe spells the problem, kwa sababu, sometimes I've heard of something like a musician lost grace. No, no. Mm. Someone used to sing so well, but then all of a sudden, uh, in itwaje, ata ukisikiza ngoma, Aikuwa na aina ile kitu ya kitambo. And uh, another question uh, in terms of history and miracles. Mm. Uh, this one comes from our audience member. Mm -hmm. uh, ulikuwa kwa video ya Lango Lango. Mm. Used to, hiyo kitambo before you launched mm. your career. Ama zilikuwa zinenda up to par. Mm. And uh, Pastor Pius amepotea for a while. Mm. And you used to be in that church. You still go to? I was in the video. To oh, back, as a backup artist. Oh, as a backup artist. Yeah, with other singers. You can see Sarah Kay there. Okay. So we were there to help back him up. 
when he decided to sing. Otherwise, we had been singing for many years before, before. him. Okay. And then uh, <coughs> the question is, uh, Pastor Pius is among, and we, we, we are, say, alleged, mm. because we don't know. Amekwana, since he ran for president, I, I remember growing Pastor Pius was the, Maget, Pastor Pius was, as in, tulishika redio, kwetu. Hii shika redio. Tulishika redio. Do you some... Dio mpone. Glass magic tuliweka. Tuliweka magic for glass. But sasa, as someone, I believe, interaction yako on that level, maybe you guys are friends. When you hear such allegations leveled against them, as a good Christian, what's the first thing that comes to your mind? Um... I think there will always be, because I personally, from a personal level, I respect Bishop Moiru as a man of God. I respect him. Yes. And so I've got nothing to say about any negativity. I don't see any negativity yeah. around him. I respect yeah. him as a man of God. And I think sometimes we, we, we look for negative things to, to push to people, even yeah. where, when, there's when there's nothing. Yeah, when there's nothing. So that's all I can say. That's a very yeah. good yeah. way to put it. Mankush, when a pastor is your friend and I'm accused of such, eh, ni aje, ye ni religious gymnast, what comes to your mind first? What comes to my first, uh, mind first, ni ye mwenyewe binafsi, as a person. Yes. Kwa sababu, when, you, an, when a soldier is wounded in the battlefield, yeah. he does not uh, 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 finish the, 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 the title soldier. Yes. He yes, is yes, only yes. called a wounded Soldier. Yes. If in my my area of jurisdiction, yes, a pastor who is my friend falls in that temptation, he is a wounded pastor. <laughs> the problem is, most of them, when they heal, they don't go back to the wood. They always look at the wound. The wood. That's the failure of many people. If you keep on looking at the wood, you'll never go forward. Let the wood remain there. Tuko na wood zinyigi dadi. Ni vila zi achomoka. Wata ni kuambia kitu moja. Kamete, maximum. Yes. Wara wa meshikwa, siyo wabaya kuliko shishi. Ni kushikwa wa meshikwa. Na kwa hiyo point. Ni kushikwa wa meshikwa. Kwa hiyo point ya... Kwa hiyo point ya committee, by the way, someone said, um, someone uh, re 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 released ama ex uh, mentioned a very worrying statistic if it were true. Ilikuwa kwa show ya Ken Mijungu ya inaitua sidebar. So, uh, alisema, ati, a pastor said that 50% of Kenyan church leaders are former criminals. I, I, I really don't, I have never, I have never done the, the statistics to see yes. whether it is true. Yes. But I, I, I think I'm a pastor. I've never been a criminal. So I'll, I'll talk on my behalf and say, there, must, there might be those people, and there is nothing wrong to be an ex-criminal and then change and become a pastor. There is nothing wrong. Hii kazi ni ya mungu, siya ya mutu. Na kama mungu wa mekuita ndani ya hii kazi, dadi, ya edi ya nakulipa. Wara wa mejiita, wanatabika sana katika huduma bwana hata utawaona tu wanatabika wana mpaka wanaharibu voice zao ati dio wasikike wako na bwana sasa kikoni i want to tell you something that is lacking manners with your voice do you uh, he's speaking in tongues, uh. speaking in tongues, speaking in tongues. Mm. There are things that I'm in English accept. In this world, we cannot explain. Uh, you're speaking in tongues. Mm -hmm. How do you know mtu wana dramatize na mtu mwenye ako kwa roho? You can't know. It is not your work. Oh, Why sorry. should you jump to something that not belong to you? Na hiyo diyo shida hile muko nae kwanza njini watu wa wafre. Ah, wewe. Ah, Sikisa hapa. <laughs> Sikisa hapa. <laughs> Munarukia kazi haimuhusu sienu. Mimi yata nikiwa kanisani, mutu aseme kuraba shanda. Na mwingine aseme adika na penso futa na raba. I don't mind. Sipeani, sipeani ruga, sipeani dimi, mimi siponyi, na mimi siokoi. Unaona, watu wakiokoka, ata wanisaidi, as a pastor, wakitoa sadaka, na furaia. Lakini wakiokoka, wanaeda kwa mungu. Mungu diya mewaokoa. 
Mungu ndiye anapeana hizo dimi. Whether you are dramatizing them, whether you are real is none of pastor's business. So let's not dwell on that. Another question, brother. <laughs> Esther umesema hiyo ya speaking in tongues a personal kama man kush. Yeah, it's it's um the Bible says it's the Holy Spirit interceding for you yes. in a groaning that cannot be understood in uh, in human terms or in human language. So it is between the person and God. It is not possible for you to tell whether the person is speaking or not. Uh, you know, I asked that because uh, one time I went nilitokea uh, mbele kuombewa. Hiyo kuenda mbele hapo kwa maombi. So kila mtu alikuwa anaanguka. So na mimi nilikuwa nashindwa. The previous times nimetokea mimi siangukani. <laughs> so what happened is wakati niliyekelewa mkono nikasema uh, labda wacha nijiwachilie huko chini labda ndio labda huko chini ndio kuna happen. So vile nilianguka chini nikapata nikakaa siku anajua time ya kuamka ni saa ngapi alafu mtu anajuaje e, masaa imefika na I, I was not even sure how to feel hapo ndani because nilianguka by guilt from guilt guilt ndio niliangusha unaget and uh, that got me thinking tulikuwa wangapi hapo chini wenye wameanguka na guilt man kush wacha nikwambie kitu moja <coughs> kuanguka haikuanza na mapasta okay kuanguka ilianza na Yesu wakati alikuja kushikwa katika ile shamba ya Gethsemane yes walimuuliza Uh, tunatafuta Yesu akasema ni mimi wote wakaanguka walianguka mara tatu na waliposimama still walimshika kwa hivyo kuaguka to me means nothing kwanza ni kuchavulia watu maguo na kuchavua watu you get me that, 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 that does not mean that the pastor have power because somebody is falling down yes what matters is huyu ame fall down akiamuka ametendewa kitu kuna kitu ametendewa ama alikuwa tu anafanya unajua hata kuna watu wengine wanaokoka kwa sababu ya kuhurumia pasta pasta amehubiri hapa anasema kuna mtu hapa anataka kuokoka ni nani watu wanaangalia wanaona hakuna mtu anaokoka inakuza hata mwenye ameokoka ndio pasta asiaibike anainua ni anainua mkono let me tell you there is a lot of gymnastic in churches and in religion area you know And that's why I tell you and I want to tell you right now I teach the word of God I don't preach the word of God I teach because mwalimu yule alinifundisha kuandika jina Paul Kuria Waweru my name hakunipitia yeah alinifundisha na ile kitu umefundishwa inakaa kuliko ya kuhubiriwa Unaona kuhubiriwa ni moto ya makaratasi. Alafu unaisha lakini ukifundishwa neno linaingia ndani yako mpaka unasema I'll not even carry the Bible. Yes. I have transferred the word of God from those papers to my heart so that I'll never sin against my God. Watu wanaweka Biblia chini wanafanya madhambi alafu wanaibeba kwa sababu it is not in them. Yeah. But once once the pastor transfers the the Bible from the papers yes. to people's heart That is when now the word of God inashika nari. Aya. Umesema, umesema wenye wamesikia wamesikia Esther Home you have a new song and uh, I'm so I'm so actually it touched me that vile niliona nilishangaa how comes the world doesn't know about it. Hiyo ndio katelu uko unasema People no it's choose. a new song it's a new song oh, so yeah i must time. appreciate i've always been given a lot of support in this country and in yeah. other countries my music has been given a lot of support for years it's been 25 years in yeah. the industry yeah 25 years yes that's almost as long as mankush has been preaching mm. uh, i've preached now for 32 years <laughs> 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 uh, it's it's a uh, It's uh, wonderful to have gospel ancestors on the show. <laughs> <laughs> you can even call us dinosaurs. We don't mind. <laughs> And now in your 32 in your 32 years of preaching, first in your 32 years of preaching, they are now talking of uh, suggestions to regulate the churches. How do you feel about that? Uh, <laughs> that is impossible. Not possible. It is not possible. Kwa sababu 
Joy Center ambao ninahubiri si ya Mugu ni yangu. <laughs> mungu hana kanisa. Hata moja. Na hata sasa hivi nikikutana na yeye duniani nitaita polisi kwa sababu hajazaliwa. <laughs> na ni yeye alisema ndio ukuje duniani lazima uzaliwe. Na mwenye amerukia pembeni ni mwizi. Na ndio sababu tunapenda Yesu sana. Kwa sababu alizaliwa. Alitoa kwa Mungu na akazaliwa. Lakini baadaye akahubiri tu miaka tatu akatoroka. Sisi tumehubiri nao that two that two years. Na bado tunaendelea. Unaona bado niko na nguvu. Mankush wewe ile sikiza nimalize. Sikiza nimalize. Sikiza nimalize. Na unisikie sana nimalize. Serikali ikiingilia kanisa that's the end of the government. Kazi ya kanisa ni kuombea serikali ipate nguvu. Sasa tena wanataka kuregulate. Oh maombi yao ya kupata nguvu. Eh. Hey. Na na wakati wa campaign wote wanajaa kwetu. Kwanza mimi nachukua advantage sana wakati wa campaign. Haya. Sawa sawa. I wish I wish we had I, I wish I wish I, I wish we had more time. Uh, Man Kuch is always a great guest on the show. And where is that, Sinio? What my question is? Ah ah. Next time, Musi say meivo. Kuwa artist. Kuwa ulize. Ana uwa. Aya aya. Aya. Man Kuch ni mui. And Esther Wahome has also been a great guest. What my question is, Esther Wahome? Asante sana. Thank you. Asante sana. God bless you. Asante sana. I'm really really grateful mm. for making uh, for you guys coming out and making this episode happen. Uh, go check out Ngoma ya Esther Home Mpia. Inaitwa ninavyokupenda. Ni poa sana. We are brought to you by Dreamland Music Empire. Uh, I know God will bless you as you watch it. Haya sawa. Ninavyokupenda. Haya. Also like I said, uh, maybe Bona mimi utagasi kanisa yetu. Jo, jo. Okay, sir. Lakini wacha tu imejaa.